So this is the Burton's small animal gastroscopy training model that comprises the esophagus. And as you'll see, the esophagus narrows slightly as you come down over the base of the heart to the cardiac sphincter. Just glancing the lesser curvature there, round to the bowl at the back of the stomach, where we can see some dysplasia to the pyloric antrum. Into the proximal duodena, where we have a polyp. And on um, pairs patches displayed here. To the first flexure in the duodenum. So, so the changes in the mucosa, which could be representative of IBD. Back out of the pylorus into the stomach. folds working their way from the cardiac sphincter down to the pyloric antrum. We've got some ulceration and some changes in the mucosa here. Back out into your esophagus. 